I almost forgot about this chart. Uh, if you look there towards the middle, um, what it says is uh, mid-2023, which is uh, pretty much right now, um, is when Earth takes its turn um, passing through that uh, spiral band or galactic sheath. Um, all the other planets that have passed through it before already went through their own uh, kind of minor cataclysms, I guess you'd say. Earth uh, planet changes, uh, atmospheric changes, violent storms, um, massive auroras, both poles, giving out x-rays, etc., etc. Um, Earth apparently is supposed to pass through this sometime now. Um, and so when all this stuff has been happening around the country, the military and all the movements, uh, you know, in pretty much every state, on the streets, doing some kind of drills or operations for seems to be like um, seems to be some kind of I don't know civil unrest that they expect because um, they hauling around you know bundles of uh, razor wire um, Humvees with the active denial systems on them you know it's just it's just really strange and then you have the Schumann residents doing some very weird and unexpected things today for the first time I've never seen it uh, act like this it's usually what the top looks like you know with kind of like the straight up and down but today for some reason we had this cymatics looking frequencies um, showing up on the Schumann resonance which is I don't think that's ever really happened before so there's definitely something going on um, could be why all the military is moving around I went and checked uh, asteroid tracking, and apparently this weekend there was um, this asteroid DZ-72, something like that. It's um, dubbed uh, City Killer, and that was supposed to be passing between the moon and Earth um, Saturday morning. And then this evening, this is what I photographed at my backyard before sunset. Uh, you can kind of see, coming from the left, there's that little little trail that cuts through you almost got like a little little sphere at the very front of it um, that's definitely another one of those passing objects um, so that kind of lines up with their uh, asteroid tracking that might be why the Schumann's acting up you know I'm not really sure but it seems like this year um, middle of the year something something big is supposed to happen I know a lot of people like Mike from around the world has talked about uh, some big weather events that are that are about to happen. There's a lot of a lot of things going on in the world. Um, you know, the sat phones being given out to all the congressmen not too long ago. Um, there's just a lot of weirdness going on. And if uh, that chart that's been right about pretty much every other planet is close at all, then we definitely have some kind of event coming in the middle of this year, uh, any time now. Um, you know, I'm just showing some some more examples of these objects passing by, passing through the atmosphere, um, doing what they do, not uh, not your typical clouds. They always have the same identifying marks, trails, spherical shapes at the front, you know, bow wakes, ion bleed off trails. I mean, pretty unmistakable. You don't see clouds like that just forming randomly. You don't see impressions or bulges like this in the atmosphere, as if something's cruising over the atmosphere. So, I don't know. Just wanted to bring that to everybody's attention, put my two cents in. I definitely believe that something, something big's going to happen, you know, worldwide, regional, not exactly sure to what degree, maybe just strong storms, extreme storms, maybe more of that St. Elmo's fire, San Bartica fire, uh, plasma fires, um, you know, could be what's been spontaneously popping off all these Canadian fires, um, you know, it may not be the government lighting it off, you know, it, it may be these uh, plasma fires, you know, wherever there's these strong electrical currents, you know, coming off the sun and hitting the earth, you know, they charge the atmosphere.
basically you get this St. Elmo's fire, this plasma fires that, you know, get attracted to, um, attracted to points higher up, you know, flagpoles, tree branches, you know, rooftops, power lines, you know, that kind of shit, metal, and that kind of stuff, you know, can burn trees from the inside and start these fires spontaneously with a big blast of electrical current from the sun. So maybe the government knows something we don't, and that's why they're doing all these military drills all over the country and preparing for some kind of civil unrest. Maybe the grid goes down or, you know, I don't know. I don't like to the conspiracy theory too much, but it's definitely something.